Each season of Call of Duty, Modern Warfare 3, and free-to-play Battle Royale Warzone includes crossovers with other pop culture franchises. The games have seen King Kong, Dune, and more in past seasons. None of them have been that enticing to me, but then again I'm not the audience since I don't play COD. Hold on. I'm being handed a note. Holy SHIT. Guys they are doing a Gundam crossover the RX-78-2 MS-06S Zaku 2 and XVX-016 Gundam Aerial. It's a nice collection of old and new models from the franchise, but I think they should have gone wild and made an operator skin for iconic antagonist Char Aznable. He's just a guy in a funny outfit, and I want to see him go wild with a machine gun. The packs will also include special death effects, emblems, charms, decals, and more goodies. No word on pricing yet, but expect it to be in line with past crossover bundles which have cost 2,400 COD points each, which is the equivalent of $20 in real money. For those who don't purchase the bundles, Season 4 will also have a Gundam-themed event, which also currently has no release date. Don't be surprised if there is also a special item you'll get for buying all the packs, as was the case with both the King Kong and Dune bundles. I just love the idea of running around a fairly realistic military shooter as a giant robot with colorful paint and a laser sword. The Gundams won't be as big as they are in the franchise traditionally, which kind of makes it even funnier. It just adds to the absurdity of Warzone skins, which makes it feel like a cosplay event where Timothy Chalamet can get wrecked by a robot or Nicki Minaj. Also, ever since the excellent Hero Shooter Gundam Evolution was shut down in November of 2023, this may be the closest thing. Publisher Bandai Namco announced that Call of Duty will be getting a crossover with the legendary Mobile Suit Gundam Mecha anime franchise. The crossover could contain new Gundam-themed skins, themed weapon blueprints, and accessories for current Call of Duty titles like Modern Warfare 3 and Warzone. Mobile Suit Gundam is one of the best-known anime brands in the world. Originally created in 1979 by Yoshiki Tomino and animated by Studio Sunrise in Japan, the series greatly influenced anime as a medium and helped redefine the genre of mecha anime, anime shows dealing with giant robots and other machinery. The series spawned dozens of spin-offs, sequels, subseries, and other brands under the Gundam banner, including Gundam Wing, Gundam Seed, and G Gundam. Bandai Namco even published and later shut down Gundam Evolution, its own Gundam-themed multiplayer shooter. Fans of Call of Duty, Warzone are finding a legendary weapon one that was prominently featured in Treyarch's iconic Black Ops franchise. Now the legendary robots are headed to the current king of multiplayer shooters, Call of Duty. Bandai Namco announced the event with a brief video teaser posted on YouTube and its official social media accounts. With Season 4 of Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3 and Warzone launching on May 29, 2024, more hints are emerging about what is being planned to be added to the game. Bandai Namco's teaser for the Gundam crossover in Call of Duty was light on details, beyond confirmation that the crossover will go live sometime in Season 4 of Call of Duty. The clip posted to social media accounts and the official Call of Duty YouTube channel only contained a brief look at what seems to be a Japan-themed map. The shadow of a massive Gundam mecha, the titular mobile suit, projected onto a large pachinko parlor building. And while the specific model of Gundam being projected onto the building was not immediately clear, its outline revealed several telltale features. Across multiple Mobile Suit Gundam anime series, Gundam Mobile Suit designs have included features like a signature V-fin antenna projecting from the head and wielded beam sabers housed on the backpack and jutting above the shoulder. It remains to be seen just what Bandai Namco and Microsoft have planned for the Call of Duty and Gundam crossover, but there's no denying that the franchise has reached farther and farther in search of brands and franchises to bring into the world of Call of Duty. Recent crossovers even featured Call of Duty cosmetic packs based on Warhammer 40k and the Dune live-action films, as well as pop culture personalities like Cheech and Chong and long-running in-jokes like a dinosaur operator. Released in November of 2023, Activision's Call of Duty, Modern Warfare 3, 2023, continues Captain Price's story from the 2019 and 2022 games.